This really tells you an awful lot about the human heart, doesn't it? When we look at our own hearts, we see that sense of self-centeredness and aggression, domination, and sometimes even absolutizing violence. And what better way to rationalize our aggression than to give a supernatural reason for our own natural inclinations? But in this question, there are two assumptions. Number one, that religion has been the only thing that has engendered all kinds of violence. The truth is irreligion has engendered a lot more. When atheism has been the undergirding philosophy, think of the slaughterers by Joseph Stalin, who, by the way, was once upon a time a seminary student, renounced his faith in God, and became an atheist, killed millions of his own people. The Pol Pot regime, Mao Zedong. History is replete with examples of people killing for various ideologies, which means it leads you to this conclusion, that we ought not to make the mistake of judging a worldview by its abuse. You must judge a worldview by what it asserts, and then see the justification it presents. So this really tells you and me more about our hearts than about anything else.